Lastly, the Spanish club went to a competition. They did well enough in the competition to qualify for state. Here's Profe with more on the story. This past Saturday, we went to uh, the University of Arkansas at Monticello and participated in the uh, regional Spanish uh, fairy competition. Uh, I say Spanish, it was also uh, French, it's foreign language they called it, foreign language conference. Took several students with me, there were, there were 10 total. Uh, they just did a fantastic job, way beyond anything I could have imagined. Uh, we wound up with four first place ribbons, two second place ribbons, and just a, a boatload of third place ribbons. Uh, it's a really good job. We had a couple who filled in at the last minute, did a fantastic job. Uh, they worked real hard on this. Uh, we entered the drama competition, uh, talent. We had Carrie Hollis singing, did a fantastic job. Everything went well, and they all qualified to do the same thing at the state level. So we're going there on the 13th of March to compete at UCA. And uh, I may be dreaming big here, but you know we're not going unless we're planning on winning. And I really think that we have a shot in some of these areas, even at the state level. But once again, I just want to say thank you to everybody who participated. At many world-famous universities, like Oxford and Yale, students live and learn and play together in residential colleges. 12 years ago, UCA became Arkansas's first public university to establish learning communities inside residential colleges. UCA is proud that these students make better grades and enjoy higher graduation rates. Another reason why UCA is the center of learning. I had a very good high school chemistry teacher. Her name was Mrs. Orr, and she made it fun and she made it interesting. And we did a lot of lab laboratory experiments in her classroom. So I really enjoyed it. I'm, I'm a well. I'm not necessarily the only child. I have a, a brother, so I've never had sisters. So when I went to the campus uh, UAPB for my undergrad. Uh, I met some of the sorors of Delta Sigma Theta and I was very interested in becoming a member because of some of their public service, uh, things that they did on the campus and also because I never had sisters. So it kind of gave me uh, a double plus because I got uh, the advantage of having sisters that I never had at home and I also got to be part of public service organization. Um, no comment. <laughs> no comment. So we'll let that be. Remember that uh, one of the biology teachers was telling me that they were doing dissections, and the next thing you know, we were on the third floor. The teacher below her was, because uh, she was kind of warning me, uh, she saw bits and pieces of frogs going out the windows because the students were cutting them up and they were dissecting them and then they were tossing them out the window. So that was kind of funny because it was raining frogs for that day. It's something we ain't ever had before. Get your arms out of your shirt. I hate English more than I Well, it's really boring, to tell the truth. The news is great. I love it. It's very fun. Yeah. And I rated it a five. I say a ten. Man, I think it's great, man. Y'all need to keep that going, man. That's what's up. Hey, man, but y'all need to add a lot more sports, like other than school sports, man. Like national sports, like college and... NBA and stuff. The Watson Chapel News is good, but short. I like the weekly raps and everything. That's yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Um, yeah, I think it's dope, yo. I just, you know, I think y'all doing a good job. You look like you getting somebody in trouble. I don't want to get in no trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it.
get into it. Come on. We Get Rap is back with Olympic flows. This beat is Michael Phelps. It's Olympic gold. But the swimming's all over like canned tuna. It's the Winter Olympics in Vancouver. And who knew this city was so nice? Well, just ask Lindsey Vaughn and maybe Sean White. And you know, Canadians feel it in their souls. They just won their first two hometown goals. But R.I.P. to the loser who passed. He died in the crash. He was zooming too fast. And he wasn't the only one who got killed. Across the globe, this war is real. Yeah, while we're rooting like Olympic fans, our troops are dying, rooting out the Taliban. Not even Bush gave this big a push with troops in the foothills of Hindu Kush. And Pakistan now the leader of the Taliban. Now they're holding him, trying to get the man to fold it in. But wave bye bye to Senator Bai. His whole career will end with a sigh. He said his job's not fun when the senators are fighting and don't get stuff done. I wonder if the whole country would all be better if we went to Mardi Gras and party together. The coolest pharaoh we know. Killed by a mosquito. Yeah, some say malaria killed the child king. Looking deep into the past is the wildest thing. Michelle Obama's ancestors must be amazed. She's the first first lady who descended from slaves. Her husband wants to create a deficit commission to check all the spending in our system. These other rappers can't compete. They're all imposters. I'm the athlete. They're all talk like Bob Costas. Flow cab. All the haters can stay shook. Put the fans online. Check us on Facebook. Woo! I'm on the pursuit of happiness.